Audio Mastering Secrets. Okay, you just saw the effects processors I use in audio mastering. Now I want to show you the mastering chain, the signal path, which is the order that these effects are in on your stereo out, your main out. What order you put them in. The first processor I use is number one in the chain is my EQ, uh, standard five band. This is a UAD Cambridge, but your standard five band equalizer is the first one. Uh, the second one, which is uh, Ozone here, I'm using Ozone 4 uh, in order. Number two is this equalizer. If I use it, it will be the second one, uh, the mid-side equalizer. Uh, mastering Reverb, I put three. It's very rarely used, but if it is, it is in the third spot. The fourth spot is my multi-band compressor multi-band dynamics it's called in ozone but it is basically a multi-band compressor uh, number five my spectral enhancer harmonic exciter spectral enhancer uh, that's number five number six is a stereo widener which is stereo imaging they call it uh, seven loudness maximizer that's always last in the chain uh, some people have different variations a little bit, move things in or around. I mastered over 40,000 songs for 7,500 clients. That's the chain I used. It works. I have no reason to switch that signal path to something different. It works for me, and, and, and everyone loves it. I have one extra thing here, which uh, you know maybe a lot of other people don't even know about this, but sometimes I'll go to the channel this is the channel and we'll go on the channel and I will put a de on here and DS this track uh, on the track channel not on the master out the stereo out on the track channel uh, if there's too much S I'll DS it sometimes it works usually many times it does work now if it uh, the de-esser uh, messes up your guitars a little too much, it messes up your high end, then obviously you cannot use it on here. But many times you'll find that if the S is too sharp in the vocals, you know, just throw the de-esser right on the channel, you know, dial it in, listen to the song, always go by your ears. A lot of times you can get rid of that sharp S sound. So that's your signal path uh, mastering chain. Get the book, Audio Mastering Secrets a number one bestseller on Amazon. There's a lot of graphs and charts in the book, not included in the video. Helps you follow along a little bit better and get your masters sounding the very best they can. If you enjoy this video, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. This will allow me to create more advanced videos and I'll have some prize giveaways too.